Lately, I've been trying to get back into a productive growth, but honestly, it's been tough. So, I decided to revamp my self-care routine to help me find my motivation again and kickstart my mornings. First, I start by making my bed. It helps set a positive tone for the day and gives me a small sense of accomplishment right off the bat. Next, I'll charge all of my devices and set my phone to me time mode, ensuring I focus solely on myself today. Before I start my day, I like to hydrate myself with a cup of warm water. I then unpack all of my items from my bag, returning everything to its original place. While doing this, I also realised how important posture is. So, I bought myself a posture corrector and I'm planning to wear it while I tackle my tasks today. picked up a few new books and I'm really excited to share this haul with you. This year, I've gotten into reading self-help books to work on myself and learn new things. I've always been a curious person, always looking for answers to my questions. Therefore, reading really helps me to understand myself better and make room for improvements. Thank you.
decided to give my shelf a little makeover for my new books. Does anyone remember Squishies? They were such a big part of my childhood. I kept a few, but I ended up throwing most of them away, and I kind of regret that now. And this Fujifilm camera, it is still usable today. I even have some leftover film, but I think it's probably expired by now. Here is the after, and I organize them through their height and color as well. Afterwards, I like to do a bit of journaling to help get my thoughts out of my mind. And I also did some meditation to clear my mind and relax. I'll move on to reading. I always try to read for at least 30 minutes each day. And reading just for 30 minutes a day can really add up over a year. And I just calculated, it's about 182 hours of reading. And that's plenty of time to explore new ideas, deepen my understanding, and even develop new skills. Plus, it's a great way to unwind and escape into different worlds. Listening to music helps me set the tone for the day and boost my mood. It energizes me when I need a pick-me-up and it calms me when I want to relax. I like to spend some time drawing as a form of relaxation. It allows me to take a break from the hustle and bustle of my daily life and brings me a sense of joy and accomplishment. After drawing, I always make sure to clean up my desk. It helps me keep my space organized and clear, which is essential for staying focused and productive. Before I end my day, I always make time for my skincare routine. It's a nice way to emphasize the importance of self-care at the end of the day. Now, 
enough of me, let's hear about you. How do you start your day with productive self-care habits? Let me know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to check this out too. And I'll see you in the next one.